Hi, I'm Gloria Brooks, founder of Nature Glows eScience, and here I am. I'm at Wild Willie's Hot Spring. I'm walking this sort of pebbly boardwalk, <laughs> uh, cobble walk towards the hot spring. So how are you homeschoolers doing? Some of you are brand new at it. I know in the times that we're living, really intense. Um, some of you are trying to figure out if you're sending your kids back to school. Kids are scared to go back to school. Parents are scared to send their kids back to school. It's a real issue, you know? Whew. I don't have children, but I have been teaching for over 20 years. And, uh, uh, you know, I've never lived through times like this, neither of you. It's our first time living through a pandemic. So what are we to do? You know, what are we to do? Uh, getting, getting out into nature <laughs> is, is, is a real healing bomb. Um, I'm up in the Mammoth Lakes area, and it has never been so crowded in all the six years I've been here. People are coming out and connecting with nature. And it's, it's healing them. Uh, get your feet bare in the earth. Let your feet, your bare feet, let as much of your body touch the earth. And uh, science has proven that the electromagnetic waves in the earth actually uh, de-stress us. So we actually get rid of, what is it, ions or, or whatnot, the, the negative charge that we're carrying from all the devices. Here I am with a device now, talking to you on a cell phone. <laughs> but uh, let your body touch the bare earth. Let your skin touch the earth. Feeling stressed out? Lay down on the ground. Lay down in the grass. <laughs> Phew. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. So, homeschool. Homeschooling is coming up. And some of you are new at it and are stressed out over it. And I get it. You know, if you've never taught kids before, it's like, what, what the heck? But here's, here's the thing. Kids are natural learners. Yeah, you could just leave them alone and they would learn what they want to learn. Okay, but most of you are not going to do that. Some of you will. Called, uh, it's called self-directed education. Um, and there have been amazing experiments done with this where you let kids just do their thing and they learn. They learn to read, they learn math, they learn whatever they want, they master it, uh, they use the adult tools, they're fascinated with adult tools, such as, you know, devices. That's why they want to look at devices all day long, because they're the adult tools, they want to master them, okay? And whether you believe this or not, just watch your kids. Like, you know, you might think it's play, but actually playing is learning. Play is is kids language for learning okay every play everything that they do with play is a skill is an adult skill that they're preparing for life all right so we'll talk more on this but um, don't be afraid to de-school what's de-schooling just not doing schoolish things workbooks curriculum um, just let it go let it go for a while. And here's the one thing you can do for state testing or state um, reporting. Keep a notebook. Have your kids journal. You know, do a circle time in the evening where you just journal together during your de-schooling period. How long should you de-school? That's up to you and your, you and your family. You know, you can... Uh, Deschooling is actually what unschoolers pretty much do all the time. They just follow their learners' curiosity, give them the tools to learn whatever it is that they want to learn. So, a few tidbits there for you. Uh, just get out into nature. De-stress out in nature. I'll be back with some more cool stuff. Thank you for watching. We'll be in touch soon. Bye-bye. Nature Glow here, signing out from Nature Glow's eScience. Bye-bye for now.